Hey, uh, welcome to Adventures by D. We're back at Mercier Orchard. It's a place we love in Blue Ridge, Georgia. We're getting ready to pick strawberries, which unlike apples, doesn't happen that long. Just a couple weekends, so we're excited. The cost was $12 per person, and you get to pick a basket. One person, one basket. So it's $12 to ride out to the strawberry fields and get them picking. But uh, I'm looking forward to it because I love ripe strawberries. Thank you. Well, Dave, we've arrived at the strawberry field. It was really a quick tractor ride, wasn't it? Very quick when you see the video <laughs> in time lapse. But no, it was really quick. It's so interesting seeing all the areas in the orchard that they actually haven't planted in yet with all the different types of things here. So we've been here for blueberry picking. We have a video for that. We've done strawberry picking before, but this will be our first video we put up for that and they have apple picking which is really what they're known for and we're going to have a whole set of videos on apple picking in blue ridge coming up this fall so stay on the lookout for that let's pick some strawberries let's go He's going fast. <laughs> you. Good. 10 adventures by Z. Fresh, sweet. Mm. Been out here five minutes. Look, I'm almost done. That's how many they are. I've never, even when we picked last time, there weren't this many. Wow. Awesome. Look at this one right here. Look at this one. Oh, guys, look at that. And let me give you a shot. So how they work it is the picking time is 10 to 4 on weekends. They announce it on the internet and their social media if they are picking. So depending on conditions, meaning rain, mud, or availability of strawberries, they'll let you know if they're picking for the next day. And you buy a basket, and the basket is $12. Uh, you have to pay money to be on the tractor, so everybody's buying something and you come and pick and you pick whatever you want here and shove as much as you can in the basket and then you take the tractor back but twelve dollars includes the tractor ride and a, and a um, bucket of strawberries here excuse yes. me a basket of strawberries so you don't pay extra for the tractor
trying to fit as many as I can. It's getting close here. Someone's gonna come out. Okay, let me keep going. Beautiful strawberries. All right, I'm gonna go try and find Dave where he is in the field. Oh, I see him. He's like way down there. So I'm gonna go find him. Here we go. That's the strawberry bomb right there. It's, it doesn't get any better than that. Just ripe, as many as you can pick or eat in your basket, they're all over. Gonna be some good eating. Oh my God, it is so, oh, whoops. It is so soft. Do you see it? Like I couldn't even, okay, I'm gonna just do that. Don't let the strawberries see. Don't let them see their friends getting eaten. You guys can see how juicy it is. I mean, look at the, that's just from this one I just picked. I think they're ripe. <laughs> oh, look at this one. I am trying to pick them with the top still intact. Are you supposed to do that? Um, I don't know. I think it would help keep it fresher. I know that obviously when you cook it or whatever you eat it, you take it off, but there's so many. It's crazy. So here's our haul. I shoved in every single thing I could. There's literally no more room and hopefully we don't lose any on the tractor, that there aren't any casualties. We're eating. We're inside the orchard at the cafe where they have breakfast and lunch. We got this uh, apple French toast. It has a fancier name in the menu. And I got Dave sausage with it. You can choose sausage or bacon. And then I got the Mercier Mountain breakfast, which has scrambled eggs. I also chose bacon. And you have your choice of English muffin, biscuit, or toast. And of course, I chose a biscuit. I mean, come on. And then I also ordered a side of bacon so we could try the bacon. And we got two coffees and two waters. Here's the cost. I bought strawberry butter and apple butter. This is my kind of place. Oh, look. Oh, little powdered donuts. They come with it. Oh, those look good. Look at that. Yummo. All right. I'm going to try one of these cinnamon donuts. See here, I'm sorry if it's loud. I'm going to speak up. I'm gonna try one of these cinnamon donuts. They come free when you sit down. They're like little donut holes with cinnamon sugar. Mm. It's like an apple cider donut hole. Yummo. I'll just keep, keep bringing those. I do, right here. Oh my goodness. Uh, you can just set it right there. No, ma'am. Oh, wow. Let's look at this. Now, that's my kind of French toast, kids. 
made from their own cinnamon bread, I believe. Sausage and apples. Oh my goodness. And then Chris has biscuit, sausage, scrambled egg, and home fries. Chris loves potatoes for breakfast. Like, let me say that again. I don't know who loves more for breakfast. Is it me, pancakes and French toast, or her, her potatoes slash hash browns? But we both got what we love today. That looks delicious. We also got a side of bacon to go with the donut bowls. Chris's looks really good too. Dave's already like beating me to it. He's already eating. That was good cinnamon toast. I didn't even put any syrup on it. That's how good it is. Good stuff. And then mine's just the basic eggs, biscuit. You could add for four dollars more the the gravy to go with the biscuit. I just didn't do it. And of course, I'm going to use some of these guys on my biscuit. This is what they're known for. One's apple butter, but one's strawberry butter. All right. Apple cinnamon bread. Okay, yeah. good. Yeah, it's very delicious. I put a little syrup on it. Look at that. Delicious. I haven't tried anything yet. Dave's already into his meal. I haven't even tried the apple cinnamon donut bowl. <laughs> they make the best donuts here. They really do. They make the best donuts. Like you wouldn't think so, an apple orchard, their bakery here is like off the hook. If you come here and you don't get something from their bakery, you're missing out. This smells like apple cinnamon, but I, I can't tell. So, here's one of the butters. I'm not gonna... Very good, very good. I'm not gonna tell Dave which one I think is which, and we'll see what he thinks. So this is one, I'm gonna put it on my biscuit in a minute. Oh. Here's the other one. By the way, you can probably tell. Can you tell what it is from that? That looks like the strawberry. Dollywood needs to have this with their bread. That's all I'm saying. Forget the, forget the apple butter. Both are good. I don't think I've ever had strawberry butter anywhere. It's off the hook. I already bought it here before. It's like it's like strawberry jam. Yeah. The the um the strawberry butter is like strawberry jelly, but different. It is so good. And Dave asked, he's very nice, they bought me. I forgot to order. Adding the sausage gravy on top of the um meal was an extra four dollars but um dave went ahead and ordered it for me i'm sure he wants some too so we'll pay for it extra they're very nice here so we're gonna do that and by the way eating the potatoes you know they said just okay breakfast potatoes but they're like salted they're seasoned this is really good this is better than i make at home you know what i mean when i make something like that it doesn't look how it tastes it tastes really good let us know in the comments if you're like me and you're a pancake french toast breakfast, sweet breakfast, or you're like Chris, a savory, something with an egg and meat and some type of uh, potato, whether it's home fries or hash browns. Are you a sweet or a savory breakfast? Leave that in the comments. I'm sweet, she's savory, and then mass and sweet, Dean's savory. So we're split two and two. Somebody break the tie. Put down in the comments what type of breakfast you eat have to do this. I wouldn't normally film this. I'm going for the strawberry. It's like a jelly, but it's not jelly. Yeah. So good. good. Awesome. Good. Can I get you guys anything else? We're good. Thank Great. you. Thank you. That is so good. Are you sure they told you it was a butter and not a jelly. That was very clear what she said. So now I need to go buy that. We need to, before we leave, we're going to ask. 
we're gonna ask how we can buy this to bring home. Like, it's out. So, I have to watch my biscuit intake because I have the gravy for the biscuit too. And I probably need to save some for you. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna make myself room here. Just show you guys. So here's the sausage gravy. This was an extra $4. You can order just a biscuit and a gravy or anything like that. By the way, this is so hot. I shouldn't have touched this with my hands. Like I'm really regretting picking this up. That's how warm that is. So there's the sausage gravy. Like look at that. I'm sitting here and I'm loving this. It is so good. The biscuit with the gravy. Oh my gosh, the gravy, it's so it is a sausage pepper. It is very peppery, but I love pepper. Like I love that. It's so warm. And then the biscuit is a homemade, I mean, come on man. It's a homemade biscuit. Look at that. It's delicious. And then the eggs are so good. They're so good. This is an excellent breakfast. We haven't eaten breakfast out in 16 months. I don't know. Forever. And the sausage is like homemade. Like they cut. I have. I'm just gonna dip it in the gravy because why not? It's in the sausage gravy because why wouldn't I? But can you see? Like it's a homemade. So they cut the sausage. It's not perfect. That sausage is really good. All right, let's try that gravy. I'm running out of room over here. I put a little bit on my sausage. I don't have, I don't have room for any kind of. Oh, you don't want it on the biscuit, so I can save the biscuit for myself. Yes, you can save the biscuit for yourself. I just put a little bit on my sausage. It is, it is loud in here. Hopefully, you guys can hear it. Yeah. But you know what? If you have a family, you appreciate loud. You can bring kids in here and not worry about it. Excellent. <laughs> Gravy's excellent. All right, Dave, what did you think of that meal? Meal was off the hook. Breakfast outstanding. 10 out of 10 adventures by D. Best French toast I've ever had. Fresh strawberries before that. Strawberry butter is out of this world. We, it was so good. I found it in the market and bought some. Like I couldn't leave. I've never had strawberry butter. It's like strawberry jelly, but has the consistency of like an apple butter. I can't describe it. It was so good. This is definitely one of the better Mercier Orchard trips. I'm not just saying that because the kids aren't with us. <laughs> I know. It was like, what? We got to have a meal and relax and enjoy ourselves? Inside? I know. What's that? And we also went through, when we first got here, we went to the market, we bought stuff. Then we ate and we went through to the market and we bought more stuff. So we had like two rounds with the market. So we have a bunch of stuff, including strawberries in our car. We got some apples. I got that strawberry butter. We went back and got that. Um, we have fried green tomato. Well, we have green tomatoes that are going to turn into fried green tomatoes. You got some what? Cherry preserves? Cherry preserves. They, make, they have really good cherry oh, yeah. preserves. Yeah. And um, we got a couple other things. So, oh, the donuts too. Yeah. Well, with that, Make sure to like this video. If you want to see more orchard adventures to go with our theme park adventures, give us a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, consider turning that red button gray for us. And turn on that bell so you know uh, we go live in impromptu streams and theme parks. And you never know when we go live. So hit that bell so you know when we go live or a new video comes out. May the adventures be, be with you. you. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and ringing a bell. So you'll be notified of our next upload. And as always, may the adventures be with you.